welcome back to CCTV. We're here to give you the latest and greatest of Chipola College news. Now over to Haley McDaniel for the campus news. Starting August 17th, Chipola will start a five day work week. Now for our spotlight of the week. This week we're spotlighting on Vicki Milton and David Hilton where they discuss what the math and science classes will be like this fall upcoming semester. We, we want to talk a little bit today about the different math and science course offerings for fall semester. We are having uh, different types of courses offered, uh, different modalities than we have in the past. And, and I know math and science, sometimes uh, students are a little bit concerned about not having face-to-face -face classes. So we're here today to, to put our students at ease and let them know that um, we have, uh, have, have spent a lot of time planning these courses and our instructors have put a lot of time into developing these courses. And so talk to us about I exactly what math and science courses are going to be like in the fall semester. Well, I, I guess every department on campus had to make some decisions about how to offer courses. Uh, we traditionally have some courses that are very large and so uh, given we only have one chemistry instructor, we had to try to work around that. Uh, so we also wanted to make sure and ensure safety for students, but, but also offer choices. Uh, an example is the general chemistry course. Traditionally in the fall, we'll have 60 to 75 students taking that course. So we moved the face-to-face -face course to the cultural center, the old gymnasium. And so it'll be set up to accommodate up to 60 students spaced six feet apart. Uh, they have a new sound system, uh, two screens or monitors, uh, so students can see what's going on. Uh, so it's just a traditional face-to-face -face course. At the same time, because we wanted to offer students a choice, uh, there is what's called a synchronous online section. So at the same time that students are live in the cultural center, there will also be, I think now, around 15 or 18 students that will watch during that same hour and 15 minutes virtually. So it's live instruction without being in the course. Um, now, along with the lecture courses, we have labs that we are concerned about, and so we had to uh, come up with sort of a creative way to accommodate students. Uh, we'll cut the lab numbers in half and they'll either alternate hours or alternate weeks so that we can space people out. They'll still work in, in the lab as a, a lab partners spaced, uh, but this way we can, we can accommodate the students. It's different, it's a little bit new for us, but... Uh, now for our word of the week. Our word of the week is baffle gap, which means incomprehensive or pretentious language. Thanks for tuning in this week. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. This has been Alexis Hall, and stay classy, Shabola.